Hello everyone. Thank you for joining us today at uh, Children's Institute's Virtual Rep Picks. My name is Amy Dean and I'm the Editorial Director for Blue Manatee Press. We are an independent children's book publisher based in Cincinnati, Ohio. Today I will be sharing with all of you um, our upcoming titles, which you can see here look super fun. So let's get to it. Blue Manatee Press was founded in 2011 with a mission to create meaningful, enduring books that help bring grown-ups and children together. Led by a pediatrician, our team consists of experts in child development and children's literature. We publish original children's books that utilize a variety of artistic media and strive to create stories that are both educational and fun, with an emphasis on turning off screens and experience the world through hands-on, creative play. You can learn more at bluemanateepress.com. We are distributed by IPG, so you can order all of our titles through your IPG rep. Our catalog is available on Edelweiss, and you can also order our books from any wholesaler. And we're going to start with a few titles from spring 2020 in case you missed them. All of these next titles all published in April. Up first, we have the board book Mama Monarch, written by Dr. John Hutton with artwork by Sandra Gross. Mama Monarch released in April of 2020 uh, it's intended for grades pre-K to kindergarten, but really um, it's very simple and sweet, so it's for our youngest readers. Um, it's a companion to our earlier title, Sleepy Bee, and this was an IPG top shelf title, so you can find it in that catalog as well. Mama Monarch offers a very simple overview of the monarch's journey for our youngest readers. This book's vibrant cut paper illustrations and simple text are meant to inspire in readers wonder and curiosity of the natural world. On the back cover, for the grown-ups, are additional facts about the monarch butterfly, as well as a call to action of how you can help save the monarch butterfly. For Mama Monarch, we would like to partner with indie bookstores. We will make available a how-to guide for creating your own pollinator way station, which will be offered as a downloadable resource on our website, bluemanateepress.com, as well as directly offered to bookstores, librarians, and schools who request it. This could be a great way to interact with your community, offering an outdoor activity this summer or planning ahead for next spring. Also, please note that finished copies of Mama Monarch are available in the galley room. Up next, we have The Charming Peekaboo Planet, written by Dr. John Hutton and illustrated by Candace Hauptsar. Uh, this is intended for grades pre-K to kindergarten, and it is an IPG top shelf title, so you can find it in that catalog on Edelweiss. Through this charming seek and find, kids will have their eyes open to different animals around the world residing in their unique habitats. Use the clues to find the animal hiding on each page. Additional animals hidden throughout the book will spark a fun challenge for both grown-ups and curious children alike. So for example, in this spread, we see the question prompt, who's plump and pokey? To the right is a related scene where the animal that fits that description is hiding. Can you find him? Upon turning the page, readers will see the answer spotlighted. Ah, we have our answer, peekaboo porcupine. And then we go on to our next question, who waddles and slides? Do you see the answer? As noted by Kirkus Reviews, Peekaboo Planet is a sweet introduction to wild animals that promotes observational skills. You can find this adorable book uh, in the galley room with finished copies available. And finally, from our spring 2020 list, we have Little Monster Trucks Go, written and illustrated by Doug Cinco. You might recall that Doug Cinco was the author and illustrator behind such favorites as My Papa is a Princess and My Mama is a Mechanic. Little Monster Trucks Go is an IPG top shelf title, so you can find it in that IPG specific catalog. But also, Little Monster Trucks Go was a spring 2020 kids any next list pick. So thank you very much to all of you who may have voted. In Little Monster Trucks Go, gear up for this fast paced action book about a monster truck race unlike any other. Five little monster trucks encounter challenge after challenge on the racetrack, but with their amazing driving skills, a few surprising gadgets, and a little teamwork, the trucks are sure to make it to the finish line. But who will get first place? What I love about this book is that each, each of the monster trucks have really fun little gadgets. We have Sir Smash, Glitz, Catnip, Shark, and Big Cheese, who, if, I, if you don't mind me telling you, his secret gadget is a cheese grater to get through rocks. 
In Little Monster Trucks Go, as I already mentioned, you're going to see a really fun obstacle course with muddy roads, missing bridges, and roadblocks. At every turn, the Little Monster Trucks must use their unique gadgets to continue the race until, spoiler, they must join forces and transform, transform into a monster bot to finish the race as a team. Little Monster Trucks Go is for fans of Transformers, car truck books, races, monster trucks. Basically, this is for every kid who loves things that go and cool gadgets. This fun book is available in the galley room with finished copies. And now we'll move on to our fall 2020 titles releasing in October. Up first, we have Baby Unplugged, Make, written by Dr. John Hutton and illustrated by Christina Brown, the team behind such favorites as Share This Book and Gritty Kitty. This board book mar marks the 11th entry in the Baby Unplugged series, focusing on creative play, real world experiences, and screen free before the age of three. Make with boxes, sticks, and string. Imagination can make anything. Children learn best through real experiences, real people, and exploring the real world. Throughout Baby Unplugged Make, we will see fun, engaging illustrations of a diverse cast of kids depicting the many ways one can be a maker. Gardening, baking, crayon illustrations, clay, the sky is the limit. Baby Unplugged Make taps into the making it and DIY culture that many families are drawn to, as well as the encouragement to be screen free. And in particular, the timing is a little better than we had anticipated as so many people are turning to crafting, baking, and so much more in their own homes. We will be offering a make themed social media challenge, for example, a box challenge asking families to share their best box creations, a chalk art challenge, etc. Winners will receive pins, badges, and pins or badges for whatever challenges they complete. This would be a great way to encourage your young readers and your communities to get out there and be creative. And now we'll move on to Little Sleepy Solar System, written by Dr. John Hutton and illustrated by Doug Cinco. This board book is another IPG Top Shelf title, and you can find that book in the IPG Top Shelf title catalog. Little Sleepy Solar System is a primer companion to the picture book Sleepy Solar System that came out a few years ago. This board book, rich in concepts such as counting, colors, opposites, and more, is perfect for our youngest astronomers. The simple text and charming artwork, which I'm not sure if you can see on the screen, but it really comes across as a cozy, almost blanket-like feel to the illustrations, is really intended to get young kids talking about those early concepts, showing off what they know all through the lens of the colorful solar system. Event kits can be mailed to indie bookstores across the country upon request. Event kits for sleep, Little Sleepy Solar System will include coloring sheets, activity sheets, and fact sheets, or maybe trading cards, about each planet, the sun, and the moon. These activities will also be available as downloadable resources on our website, bloomantipress.com. And if I may, I'd like to take a quick sec second to point out how cute are those cold little planets with their scarves and coats. I just, I really, I love it. Uh, digital copies of Little Sleepy Solar System are available in the gallery room, so make sure you check it, you check it out. And now we have the board book, I Miss Your Sunny Smile, by Deb Adamson and illustrated by Ann Zemanski. I Miss Your Sunny Smile is a classic and sweet board book reassuring our young readers that even in their uh, sad, grumpy, or just bad days, there's always a chance to find a smile. I Miss Your Sunny Smile. How'd you lose it? Where'd it go? Let's go searching for a while. Having a bad day is never fun, but it can be especially difficult for young children to understand that sad feelings are temporary. Through gentle rhymes and warm illustrations, we see a mother helping her son find his smile again. We'll see them look at his favorite marbles. We'll see him look at his cookies in the cookie jar, doing a fun little dance. But what will make his smile come again? We'll have to keep looking through the pages to find out. Oh. We turn the page and we see that he has found his smile again. It was with his teddy bear all along. I should mention that this is early artwork. Uh, text will come in later, so this is not a wordless 
board book, there will be text um, better than what I've read for you thus far. Uh, also, I wanted to mention that Sean Aker, happiness researcher and New York Times bestselling author of Before Happiness, says about I Miss Your Sunny Smile, Deb Adamson's delightful book reminds kids that after a while, there is always a smile. And finally, I have for you today the adorable hardcover picture book, Baby Monster, by debut author Andrea Piper and illustrated by Aaron Barker. Aaron, you might recall, was the author and illustrator behind Mr. Pumpkin's Tea Party, that, which came out last fall, to great reviews. Um, Baby Monster is an IPG top shelf title, and it will be our lead title for the fall. A baby monster that is loud, fussy, and picky about food can be hard to care for, wreaking havoc everywhere. But as two exhausted scientists find out, a baby monster can also be what makes them a family. This laugh out loud tale shows what every new parent knows. Babies, even a baby monster, are messy, frustrating, lovable delights. Baby Monster makes a perfect gift for new parents. The warm humor is very relatable and serves as a great metaphor for new parenthood. But in fact, I think you'll find if you check the book out, P.S. we have physical arcs available in the galley room. Uh, Baby Monster is really, um, I can't imagine anyone not liking this one. And in fact, you can see for yourself. Please enjoy this short book trailer for the delightful Baby Monster. I hope you'll reach out to me at amydean at bluemanatebooks.com. Thank you.